guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'll be planning the week of August 29th to September 4th in my memory planner and I'll be using a kit from Paper Shire called Rustic. Um, and I believe I purchased this all, like most of these kits I purchased last year unless like there was one art, like an art that I really, really like then I'll purchase it this year. But most of the kits that I'm using in my 2022 planners were either purchased before 2022. Anyway, so um, this week is also my parents' 27th anniversary that I am planning. Um, and yeah, this is obviously a very different like kit format. So pretty much I decided to just pull in Scribble Prince Co. label sampler in rows um, just to pull it in. Um, so made it a little more cohesive and I was able to have more labels, if that makes sense. Um, so. Yeah, anyway, so pretty much um, I did put down the bottom washi as, as it is, and then um, for the sidebar I used two full boxes and then also a weekly box um, because there was no, there wasn't an extra box that I could use, and then I just ended up just pulling in two half boxes to mark out the highlight of the week. Uh, um, so yeah, and currently I'm just putting down the full boxes, trying to figure everything out, um, and here I'm just putting down the sidebar, so... Yeah, anyway, so then I also put down the glitter headers um, that came with the kit. Um, it's a little lighter than I thought it would be, but it's okay. Um, it matched with the tones of the kit. Anyway, so I will guess I will go into day by day before I start rambling on and go over the time. Anyway, so then for Monday, I marked down that... So I published five videos this week, and there's some weeks that I publish more videos than ever, and then there's some weeks that I don't publish any videos. So yeah, pretty much this was a very video happy week. Um, so for Monday, I marked down that I published my pack order um, video. Usually it's going to be my weekly plan with me, but unless I couldn't get it up in time, I usually, cause I can, I always have videos like ahead sometimes. So I ended up just posting that one and then posting my weekly plan with me on Tuesday. Then I marked down that I had work. Usually I don't mark it down, but yeah, it's, I had nothing to mark um, in this week because it was such a short week. Um, and then I watched Blood and Treasure and then I got a package from Squirrel Prince Co. And it's almost been a whole month um, since I am talking about this week. So I may not forget or like I may forget some things that, um, that I was doing. Anyway, so then um, I watched House of the Dragon um, and script is from my shop and then um the character sticker is from paper shire so if you are part of her facebook group you can get that um i thought this one was fitting enough um i know this was for game of thrones but it also works for house of the dragon and then i marked down that i packed orders and i didn't even use labels for the bottom half of or like those two sections um, are two things that I marked um, and then yeah and then for Tuesday I marked down that I published my weekly plan with me marked down I at work and I actually went into the office that day and that script is from my shop um, most of the scripts are from my shop or yeah all of them actually right yeah so this is so the work scripts are the version 2 scripts and then in the office is version 1 um, but they don't have v1 or anything it's just in the office script um and then i marked down that i had a meeting because i think it was a bi-weekly or bi-monthly meeting then um every tuesday we have catered lunch so they got chick-fil-a and it was a chicken sandwich um so and they had leftovers so i ended up just taking one on um for later on and then i decided to go to uniqlo and to go shopping um and yeah i went shopping and then i went to the dyson airwrap store or dyson store um by the office um and yeah it was just i made a big purchase and i haven't even touched it honestly speaking so i don't know if i'm going to return it or not i still have yeah i still have literally what do you call it a few more days before I can return it um so we shall see anyway so then for Wednesday I marked down that I published my September kit lineup then I had work and then I marked down that I had payday designed some stickers or actually 
Was I designing stickers or planners? I don't know. Anyway, I was designing. And then I marked down that I packed orders and my sticker paper arrived. I ordered a bunch of sticker paper um, just to replenish what I had. Um, and also needed a restock of the premium matte paper because I didn't realize that I ran out. Didn't have a second pack on me and I was like, oh my goodness. Um, so then for Thursday, I marked down that I published week 33. Then on after that marked down work got a package from once more love packed orders and then i was in my feelings um i don't know honestly i don't know why i was in my feelings can't tell you um and then friday i marked down that i published new releases i i think this was like collective like day off for my team because um it was also labor day weekend um so we ended up just not logging in um and taking pto um and then I got a package from Amazon and oh in that um like bed flat lay um like half box area is from Paper Shire so yeah and then I but I accidentally broke my glasses on Friday and I was like oh my goodness this cannot be happening to me um so I actually broke the nose piece but it came out as like one whole piece like the screw was no longer screwed to the um frame itself and I was like great what a wonderful day um and then um but my dad was able to just fix it by gluing it back into place because yeah it was I think it was all already stripped um so yeah I mean it works and it's I've still had it on since then um and then I packed orders after that um so then on Saturday, I marked down, I completely forgot to mark down that was my mom and dad's 27th anniversary, and my cousin announced that she and her now fiancé are engaged, and I'm so happy for her, um, so, yeah, and then, like, this is like a whole whirlwind of things that happened, and then I paid off my Affirm, um, so Affirm is like, like, monthly payments for, like you can there's like options and silly me did not realize that the 12 month option that i chose for to pay off the dyson air wrap um had interest in it and it already incurred um a day interest and i was like what the heck i thought it would be a monthly in interest but no it was a daily interest so i incurred like a few cents um and then realized that and i was like no 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 this is not happening so i ended up just paying it off um so yeah, I paid off what I owed for my Dyson Airwrap. Um, I was hoping to just pay it off monthly, but I'm not incurring interest for that. Um, so, yeah. Anyway, so then I had to drop off something for um, to my cousin because she was going to Hong Kong for the next four or three weeks. Um, so I just had to drop her so, drop something off to, for her to deliver to my grandma because my grandma's in Hong Kong. Um, so, yeah. Anyway, so pretty much she was leaving the next morning, so there was no time. And um, it was like a, almost a bit of a freak out because my aunt, she likes to make it everything very dramatic. Um, but she was like, don't stay there too long. You know, she has have to leave in the early in the morning. I'm like, we're not staying there anyway um, because we're not, we weren't planning on staying there a very long time. Like we stayed for like 20 minutes um, just to talk. And then, yeah, pretty much because it was also my parents' 27th anniversary which I completely forgot to mark um in the section and honestly I didn't have that much room um so pretty much um yeah I was just like chill can you just chill <laughs> we're not staying for like um the night over you know anyway so then um for my parents 27th anniversary we went to Outback Steakhouse um we were originally going to go to pub 199 in New Jersey but that would just been a long truck for no reason um and yeah um, we're going, I hope we're going to go on October 1st, but yeah, we shall see. Anyway, so then on September 4th, um, why didn't I say it like that? I have no idea. Um, so September 4th, um, or no, Sunday, I marked down that I packed orders, then I had new releases, and I believe these were the scripts, right? No, these were not the scripts. Honestly, I think, oh no, these were collections, I believe. Um, and then after that, um, we had soup dumpling, um, 
I think I went out with my dad. Yeah, it was this on um, Sunday. I went out with my dad. We had soup dumpling, and then we went to the container store, and then I watched House of the Dragon on Sunday. Usually, I try to watch it on Sunday, but life is busy, and yeah, I can only watch so many things at once. Um, so. That is pretty much my week in full. I hope you guys enjoyed this plan with me, and I will see you guys next time. Bye!